What's up, guys? Welcome to another episode of Be Creative, Be Great. Um, I'm excited today because I haven't put out some content in a while um, outside of that new video I did uh, in Guatemala. It was more of a vlog than anything else. But I'm sorry that I haven't been able to put out as, as much videos as I've been wanting to put out. But uh, with that being said, I got this new one. It's kind of cool. It has to do with lighting. So I hope you like it, but let's get into the intro before anything else, you know? to YC Imaging. I saw the video that he posted um, on YouTube about like creating a, a light, some type of like aperture type of lighting. Um, I thought it was pretty cool. So I took it upon myself to do the same thing. And I said, you know what? Let me give it a try. Let's, let's see if I can step it up a notch. So what I did was I actually took, see this here? The baking pan. And this baking pan, I actually turned in to a light I used another uh, the first revision I did was it was a, it was still a baking pan but I just you know the type of baking pan was a little bit different but um so what I did was I took this baking pan I drilled a hole in it so I can you know route the, the wires for lighting and stuff so I bought LED lights from Walmart I bought the baking pan from Walmart as well a baking pan Let's get that. I bought some frosty shower curtains from Walmart. And you'd be surprised the things that you can get in Walmart that are just like a bargain. So I got all these things, I put it together, and I made myself a light. If you can see here in this video, you can see like the, the pan that I have. Uh, it's nothing crazy. Then I have the LED lights from Monster. Monster sells some LED lighting that's bright white. Um, and those lights are actually pretty cheap. They're about five bucks. They're really good. Um, and if you wanna try this little project, I would advise you do if you need some lighting. The reason why he posted the video was because lighting could be expensive. So he was just trying to you know, inform people of creative ways to make light to work for you. So if you're in that position and you need some lighting but you don't want to spend a thousand bucks, twelve hundred dollars or whatever it is, then try making it yourself. I think I spent about 30, 40 bucks um, and put the whole light together. So I hope you like it. I hope you see what, what, what it was done. I'm using the lighting right now. I just had a stand and I just bought a hot shoe, connected into the back. I did a, some customization so I thought it could work for me. Um, so as you're building it, as you're making one for yourself, just get creative with it. Start doing things that maybe, you know what I mean, nobody else is doing and see what, what works for you and what you like for your videos. So I'm using it now. Um, actually, hold on a second. Monster also has a remote. So if I wanna turn it off so you can see the difference, this is my key light, I'm gonna turn it off. So there it is. So I'm pretty sure I look a little bit dark. Turn it on. And boom makes a big difference so with that being said go ahead get creative uh, make a light if you need a light shout out to YC imaging who, who motivated me to do this I hope you like it as well bro and you know what uh, hit me um, hit me on DM or something like that let me know what, what you think about it um, and I'm just glad that I was able to do it so you know what listen stay creative and don't settle with being good when you've been meant to be great. Later.